I'm Dr. Heather Kilmeyer. I'm the bassoon professor at East Tennessee State University. And these are the eighth grade prepared pieces. For the fast selection, you want to be sure to watch the note lengths and articulations. We want a clear difference between the staccato articulations and the tenuto marks. Uh, a good example is measure three, where we have two B flats in a row, first with staccato, the second with tenuto. In measure six, it's a good idea to practice the chromatic line for smoothness. You might try, try playing that chromatic line from the C up to the F three times or more in a row to aim for smoothness. If your A naturals crack, which is typical of A naturals on bassoon, you want to either flick the note or half hole the A natural with your whisper key. In the second selection, you want to watch for your A-flats and make sure they don't crack. A-flats usually require less half-hole than G-naturals, uh, maybe even only a quarter uh, uncovered. You also want to make sure to add your resonance key on all your Gs that occur on the fourth space. Uh, that tends to be a very sharp note on bassoon, and adding that resonance key will help us bring the pitch down. Thank you. 